light. Dang. Okay. Hello. How do I switch the camera to me? What's happening? I've not streamed on my phone for so long. So bear with me. I'm trying to switch the camera. I don't I can't see. Oh my goodness. What am I doing? If anyone is in the chat and they can hear me, let me know. I'm trying to find how to switch. I've never done a live stream on my phone for so long. So I don't even know how to switch it to my face. Oh my goodness, this is crazy. So I'm not gonna do a live stream like this without being able, hello, hello, hello. If you're coming in, let me know where you're joining me from. Yeah, I know you can hear me, but I'm trying to switch. <sighs> I'm trying to switch this camera to my face. I've never streamed on my phone for so long. And uh, I don't know how to do this. What the heck? Wait. Hello, hello, hello. How is everybody doing? Oh, hi Sheila, hi Binyam, Fitamo, Sheila, hello from Atlanta. Habesha, come. If you're not asleep, come. You said you're going to sleep. If you're not, <laughs> if you're not asleep, please come. Sasa, sister, how are you doing? Umefika wapi? Um, I'm good. Uh, can you, can hear you, but can't see you. Okay. The light is super good. Hello, greetings. How is everybody doing? So I'm in bed. Seriously, you sleep so early. Can see you, but it's very foggy. Okay, let me clear my screen. Just a second. Mm, okay, I can switch off like that. Switch to that side. Clean my left. Come to the balcony. Okay, I'm coming. Let me switch to that side. Hey, you love my braids. Thank you. Yodit. Hey, Yodit. Might be the bandwidth. Yes, I guess so. Yodit. Look at my neighbor. <laughs> Good evening, my neighbor. <laughs> how is everybody doing how are you doing so i'm just doing this live stream i mean this yeah this is my neighbor hello neighbor uh, let me remove my earphones hello my neighbor how are you doing I'm good, sweetie. you are supposed to be in this live stream if you had not slept <laughs> It's your birthday. It's your birthday. Happy birthday. Thank you. You know, somebody said on on um, uh, Instagram, uh -huh. like, how old are you turning? So I can send you a dollar for each year. I said a thousand. <laughs> so you need a thousand dollars. <laughs> Okay, so it's this girl's birthday and we came to this very beautiful place. I'll probably give you a better tour tomorrow because really, even if I told you that there's a waterfront, a lake on that side, you're not able to see that. But this is the very, very, very beautiful place. We're spending birthday weekend. Yeah. Birthday weekend with my I'm girl. No, please, we need you alive. <laughs> we don't want accidents on your birthday. No. Okay, so how's everybody doing? It's better in the balcony. Okay, so I'm back on the screen. How is everybody doing? Is the video clear right now? So I wanna just, you know, I didn't do a video about this place, so I wanna do a shit. This place is not even a place to do like in a day or two, a lot of days. So I'm just going to give you, of course, okay, let me see. Okay, I'm using mobile data. Let me switch to the Wi-Fi. Just be patient. 
Okay, let me know if it's any better. <laughs> no, I'm sorry, so sorry about that. So I switched off. I switched to Wi-Fi, but the Wi-Fi is not any better. So I'll stick to mobile data. Uh, happy Easter in the US today. Happy Easter. Let me know where you're joining me from. So I just want to give you a quick tour of this very beautiful place. But I don't think this video because of the blurriness. But over there we have water. On that side we have water that you can only see during the day. And the little lights you can see from the other side. And we have some fireplace here. So in case you're having some friends and something, you know. You can have the main door. It's closed now. Let me know if the video is clear. Am I wasting my time? If it's not clear, I'll just do a video about this later. But definitely, I'll do a video about this place. Um, This is how the balcony looks. Basically, just on that catch up a little bit this is the balcony so there's two beds there's this one breaking up oh no the connection is pathetic anyway the view is amazing so this is one of the beds on the balcony if at all it's any clear so this is what your balcony looks like some sitting place view of the lake that you can't see right now because it's night and this is to the room this is your room. Oh, some working space on that side. Tell you that I never watch. Um, tell you that I never watch some working space. Uh, some table here. Your wardrobe safe to that side. I don't have anything, so I don't need the same. Um, and I love the chandeliers. And that's to the bathroom. Looks like, oh, it's buffering. So I won't even move because if I move and it's buffering, then that makes it worse. So I'll just lie down and we have a little chat here and there before we end the stream just catching up was too lazy not too lazy too busy to edit the video yes i'm loving ethiopia so why it's not for the lockdown in kenya right now i would be in kenya and i don't know what i'll be doing in kenya because i was supposed to be in kenya for one month so I'm loving it. So far, so good. I feel like Ethiopia is one of that place that you visit and you might not be able to leave. Once you get to Ethiopia, you get too comfortable and that's how I feel right now. What is the place you are at? I'm not going to mention the place until I leave. So I'm not going to mention the name of this place for now. Not on video. But if you know, you know. If you watch my, if you follow me on Instagram, you know the place. So when I leave this place, I will mention the name of this place. Not right now, <laughs> but it's outside Addis Ababa, outside the capital city. Very beautiful place. I love it. Like it's overwhelming. Uh, thank you so much. Your hair looks fabulous. Thank you so much. It's <laughs> I've had it for too long because I don't have, um, I, 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 I've not got a place to do my hair how I want it. I felt too comfortable in Ghana. I felt at home there after just two weeks. I, I totally understand. So you see, one of the things that makes me feel so comfortable right now is the fact that, uh, right now, uh, my ticket is open for one year. So I can be here and live after one year. So I think that's making me really so comfortable that I don't have the rush to go back to Kenya. And I always say, like, when people ask me, how do I feel about Addis or about Ethiopia? 
basically Addis makes me feel like it's weekend every day like it feels like weekend in Kenya so things are not like really fast paced which is good and it can be bad especially in restaurants when you are hungry one time my last day there I nearly cried yes you can cry but I'm so glad I'm not leaving any soon so it's really nice because uh let me see I'm trying to get something to hold my camera so it's really nice but it can make you too comfortable you might never want to leave once you get to Addis you don't want to leave you get too comfortable okay let me put camera like that you'll become too comfortable to live once you get to ethiopia so i don't know i still need to continue with my 21 countries in 2021 and addis is being a, a very addis is being very distracting in this journey because it's too comfortable you don't want to leave uh, picture quality is distorted i'm sorry i think the net connection here is not as good and i guess that's the only disadvantage everything is high internet connection i hope it's clearer now oh thank you so much bali i, I don't want to murder to butcher your name so i'm gonna say times times is easier to say you're the best youtuber of all time thank you so much i appreciate a one year ticket that's great it gives you more time to explore a country you loved it in nigeria too yes you need to see the rest of your videos in the countries you're visiting i'm really hoping so Whew. um i'm gonna try and for the best way and the cheapest way is to live in Addis because as a Kenyan, I don't need this Ethiopia without traveling. So I can be best here and travel to other countries from here. It will cut my costs, I think, and the ticket price will go low because every time I'm traveling, I'm, uh, I'm always passing through Ethiopia. So yeah. Kenya is in lockdown. You are lucky to have mobility there. Yes, I'm so lucky and I'm so happy that uh, I managed, like I'd not got to Kenya before, like it went on lockdown before I got, before I left. So at least I was able to cancel my ticket. So I'm so happy because right now I've just been, I don't know what I'll be doing there. Uh, okay, it's okay, don't worry. That's why I'm not doing live streams in Ethiopia as much because the internet is not as fast or as clear. So I'm not doing a lot of live streams. I think since I came to Ethiopia, this is the first live stream I'm doing. I've not been doing live streams. Hi, Purity. How are you doing? I'm here. Wow, you're still awake. I thought you'd be asleep by now. But yeah, actually, if you're not following me on Instagram at Kenyan sister, or even if you search African tigress, you'll still find me. Like, um, you get real-time updates and, you know, all that on Instagram. Yeah, so I'm, I'm thinking about visiting all of ethiopia's neighbors i mean if i visit all of ethiopia's neighbors i would have visited or like if you take half I divide it into half i would have visited north east all of the northeast countries and the east african countries so that's what i want to do once i'm done that i go to south and then i'll go to west africa central africa would probably be but I've been to, Congo is in Central Africa, so I've been to one country in Central Africa, Congo. Then I'll do the other Central African countries and North African countries last. Thank you so much, Continua. How are you doing? Let me know if you are watching me, drop a comment, drop a flag. Let me know where you're watching me from. Uh, well, visiting all of Ethiopia's neighbors is a great idea. Yes, I have to visit. I have to visit, but I'm not so sure when I'm starting because 
of some logistics and the fact that some countries I need visas and to get the visas I'm needed to go back to Kenya to apply for visas of like I think I need a visa to Sudan I'll need a visa to Eritrea I'll need a visa to some of the neighbors so they want me to go back to Kenya to apply for those visas before I'm able to travel so that's something I'm still debating, but in the moment, I'm just enjoying my life and living my best life in Ethiopia. Um, are you going to the Gambia, Tanzania, or Morocco? I'm watching from the UK. I've been to Tanzania. This trip started from Tanzania. The 21 countries in 2021 started from Tanzania. So you need to go and check out my videos from January and early February. You're going to see a lot of videos from Tanzania. So Gambia is in the list. Gambia is in the list. And Morocco is also list, but I'm not so sure if I'm, it's going to be on the list this year. But I want to do... When I want, when I go, when I do West African countries, I want to do like a road trip. So I get to Nigeria and then do all the coastal countries, Nigeria, Benin, Togo, Ghana, Ivory Coast. I think there's Liberia, Guinea. Is it Guinea? I think there's Guinea somewhere there. Equatorial Guinea. Gambia, Senegal, all of those countries up to Senegal, and then I will fly back to Kenya from Dakar. So I start in Nigeria to Dakar and back. I would have covered 10 countries if I do that. Thank you so much, Walde. How are you doing? Are you going to South Africa? Yes, I will. Like South Africa, I think I must visit this year. South Africa is in my list. I've been to South Africa before but i didn't make as many videos so i'll definitely be going to south africa france but i'm from hmm, uh continue i'm trying to figure out this flag is which country hmm, which country is this is it mozambique no eritrea that's the flag of eritrea if i'm not wrong Either, yeah, that's the flag of Eritrea. Okay, I'm watching from Germany, from Somalia. Hey, Times, how are you doing? Uh, hey, beautiful, please name uh, 10 things about Ethiopia that you love so much. First, <laughs> first Ethiopia is too comfortable, like very comfortable. Um, one thing... Okay, number one, the fact that I feel like I'm more relaxed in Ethiopia. I feel like I'm on weekend mode all through. Monday to Sunday is just like weekend all through in Ethiopia. That's the first thing I love. Second, food is very affordable here. Food is affordable in Ethiopia. Third, I've met a lot of amazing people in Ethiopia, friendly people. Fourth, what do I like? What's the fourth thing I love? I don't know what else to add, but those are the major things that I love. And for me, the fact that I feel so relaxed, the fact that I feel like every day is weekend, the fact that, I don't know, like just that is everything to me. Oh, I love the coffee. How can I forget? Fourth is the coffee. Five is the culture. I love, like, it's it's not in many cities that you will go and find that they have a lot of cultural places, cultural displays. Like, in Ethiopia, you'd go somewhere and you at least, go, like, different places. You, you're going to get a spot where you're going to experience, like, the traditional dance, which is one thing I love. When I travel, I always want to experience traditional dances, cultural dances and all that so in ethiopia there's several places you can experience that coffee ceremonies they are all over so i totally love that yeah i think i think that what else do i love i think that those are the major things i love i don't know what else in case i've forgotten something else mm, 
have you been to Entoto Park yet? I'm definitely going there. It's in the, in the it's in the plan. It's just that I uh, I have a lot of things in the plan, so I'm doing them step by step, and you know, shooting videos, editing, and also trying to have a life. <laughs> Trying to have a life too is not easy because I don't want my life to be all just about creating videos without living the moment. Because a lot of times as a content creator, you are behind the camera, you are making videos and sometimes it's like there are some moments that you will miss or that will pass without you like really experiencing them. Because you are more focused on creating that content. So, yes, I'm trying to have that balance. So, that's what I'm trying to, instead of doing like daily videos, I'm thinking of doing like one day skip the next, like every other day. How was your day, Walde? Amazing. The best. Relaxing. I don't know. In this, in this very amazing place, I mean, like, how can you have a bad day? Uh, Gambia, I'm interested because I'm thinking of going there. Awesome. My lovely country, Ethiopia. Enjoy, sister. Thank you so much, honey. Uh, thanks to you. Uh, Ike, I'm interested and Ike, I'm interested in visiting Ethiopia. Yes, you should. For real. Like, I've met a lot of people, including yesterday. I met, like, I was at this event and I met three different people. And all of them... They, they they okay one came here eight years ago and she came here she wanted to be in ethiopia for just uh she wanted to be in ethiopia for about she said she wanted to be in ethiopia for one year she ended up being here for eight years and then last year she left to go back to her country and she just didn't feel at home so she was like i'm going back at home so she's back in ethiopia Another one came, like a lot of people I've met, once they get here, they don't want to get out. I don't know what magnet Addis has or what magnet Ethiopia has. Of course, there are challenges here, like internet is an issue. There are lots of challenges, that's not lots, but there are some challenges here. Like for someone like me, internet is an issue, but there's just something about Addis. I've met a lot of people who are maybe coming for three weeks, they end up staying I've met people who are supposed to be here for a few months. They end up being here. I've met people who've been here for 12 years. I met a Kenyan who's been here for 12 years. I've met a Kenyan who's been here for six, since 2000, 2013. So, yeah, there's just something about Ethiopia. I think Abidjan is the best city in Africa. You'll be, you'll be missing if you don't visit. I will. I'll plan and visit. I have been there before and it's dope. Okay. Okay. I will definitely visit. I was impressed. Ethiopia. Hi, Ethel. Hi, lovely. I guess you're from Kenya, isn't it? Yes, I'm from Kenya. Uh, plus, you do the Ethiopian dance as well. I can barely dance. Oh, my goodness. I can't dance. Eritrea, Ethiopia, Sweden. Is that Sweden flag or Norway? I hope. Gele. Eritrea, Ethiopia, is that Sweden or Denmark? I don't know. Uh, this is a good sign when you feel so relaxed in our country. I felt more at home in Ghana and Jamaica than I do in the UK. Yes, everything in Ethiopia is best. Welcome to Ethiopia. Thank you so much. Don't put pressure on yourself. You can always travel again next year. Your editing is great and you put a lot of effort into your videos. Yes, yes, Mariam. Thank you. I hope you'll visit Eritrea one day. You will love it. Trust me. Yeah, I, I want to visit Eritrea, but some people were telling me there is security issues right now. I don't know. Maybe you can let me know how safe is Eritrea right now. I'm moving to Faso from America. Oh, at the end month. Awesome. Awesome. I've never been there, but I hope you will love it. Probably I want to visit You'll have already gotten used to the environment and you could show me around. Uh, beautiful things. Thank you, Dave, uh, publishing the extra Malindi footage. I have a lot of footage from Malindi. 
I have footage from Mombasa that I've not uploaded. I have footage from Nigeria I've not uploaded. I have footage from Tanzania I've not uploaded. I have footage from Congo I've not uploaded. It's not easy. I wish, I wish, I don't know. I wish it was just automated. Like you take the footages and then they just edit and upload themselves. Do not forget to visit Unity Park in Addis Ababa. We want a video of it. That's a must. Like, like Unity Park is a must. Have you been to Unity Park? The best? I'll be there. Oh, it's Sweden. When are you coming to Kent, United Kingdom? You know you closed the borders in the UK. The UK banned Kenyans. Like, the UK has banned Kenyan citizens from getting to the UK. And in retaliation... Kenya has put regulations that UK or pe UK citizens or people coming from the UK getting to Kenya, they must quarantine for 14 days, I think, at some specified facilities at a certain cost and all that. Uh, are you visiting Abidjan? I was there last year. It's the best city in West Africa. It's so dope. You should try it. You'll be missing if not. I will. I will. I will. I love Ethiopia, definitely. Grandma, how are you doing? Editions are great. People, warm and friendly. I'm new to your channel and learning a lot. I'm living in Toronto. Uh, thanks for all your channel with some friends. I wish you happy Easter. Thank you so much. Island girl, how are you doing? Love the energy and your vibe. Thank you so much, Dane. I appreciate the love and the support. So hit the like button. If you're just joining us, hit that like button. Hit the like button if you are just joining us. Hit the like button. Oh, Asmara is safer than Addis Ababa. The airport has been closed since March last year and it's still... Okay, then that simply means I'm not able to get to Eritrea if the airport is closed. Uh, if Eritrea and uh, Ethiopia are fighting right now. Okay, I don't know. Hit the like button if you're just joining. Let me know where you are joining us from. There's going to be some amazing videos on this channel from Tuesday. And what if we just get to 80,000 subscribers before the end of the month? That would be amazing, right? So share out my videos. Uh, share out my videos whenever you're watching them. And just also remember that it's very important to hit the like button whenever you're watching my videos. You hit the like button. It's the least way that you can support me. If you're enjoying my videos, I mean, it's not hard. You know, just as you're getting to watch the video, whichever video you open or whichever video comes, just hit that like button. You hit the like button. It helps. It's the least way you can support your sister here. Uh, tuned in from Seattle. Hi, Sarah. How are you doing? I'm from Ethiopia. I like your country, Kenya. I like Diani. Oh, wow. Diani is amazing. It's one of my favorite places in Kenya. I love the beach. It's also very relaxed and uh, safe. I find it to be safe at any time of the day. For, like, it's active. It's, I, I don't know how I can put it. It's calm and active at the same time. Calm brunt at the same time because i don't know i don't know how it is right now during covid but uh, the last time i was there uh i would tuning in from maryland hi mary brown joining you from the depth of my mind okay the clean beach diani yes they see diani okay the last time i checked diani won the best beach in africa award white beach it's like very over 15 i think about 15 kilometers of white beach so yeah hi david how are you doing you're watching from romania oh awesome i really wish to be in ethiopia once you come to ethiopia be careful you might never want to leave <laughs> you might never want to leave but also for me, Ethiopia is very convenient as a Kenyan. I mean, we are just neighbors. So if I wanted to go to Kenya or go to Kenya or visit Kenya, now I'm talking as if I'm living here. Anyway, so if I want to visit Kenya, it's very easy. So 
it's not much. Two, I think it's about two hours by flight. There's road, but road is very long. And right now the borders are closed. So if you're not Kenyan citizen, you can actually not cross. So borders are closed right now. Ethiopia has closed its borders. So you cannot get to Kenya through by road. Uh, I'm Ethiopian, but uh, I know Eritrea is the safest to visit. And now the Italian influence and then in africa and recommended you to visit i don't understand i'm doing well here in seattle only missing my beloved motherland in kenya i can't believe i've been away from kenya for since january so i can't believe i've not eaten ugali since january i don't know how that's possible and it's just yesterday that I was thinking like, come on, like I've not eaten Ugali since January. How am I even surviving out here? <laughs> Hi, Serafina, how are you doing? Marilyn Charles, how are you doing? Uh, so good, you're enjoying your trip. Which country are you planning to go to next? I'm thinking about Ethiopia's neighbors and I'm thinking about Somaliland. I wanted to do like a road trip there, but like two days I go stop by a, a city close to the Somaliland and Ethiopia border then proceed. But I don't know. Someone told me that Ethiopia has closed all its land borders. So I don't know if that's still possible. So I'll have to go to the Somali embassy to confirm that. Mm. Hey, Fritz, how are you doing? I'm happy to discover some place in Africa with your channel. My first trip in Africa will be at Ghana after that COVID thing. Hmm, when will this COVID thing end? I feel like it just keeps getting worse and worse. Lockdowns and lockdowns and um, more restrictions. And um, I don't know, maybe it's going to be a requirement for someone to travel. You must have the COVID certificate or something, just like the yellow fever in some countries. So I really don't know. So that's why I'm just trying to use this little time before things are made compulsory to travel. Uh, been watching your videos. Keep up the great work. Thank you so much, Louis from Cayman Islands. Wow. Oh, awesome. Hi, team. How are you doing? Uh, guys, you are our heroes from Kenya. Keep it up and be blessed. Thank you so much, Sarah. I meant I'm Ethiopian, but I know Eritrea is the safest to visit. Okay, Serafina, I love you back. Where are you now? I think you are in the best resort. <laughs> <laughs> we'll confirm that in my next videos. We'll confirm that in my next videos. So, Kruft is the, the best resort. Okay. Uh, go to Eritrea. Um, I will, but I know right now someone cannot be able to access by land. From Uganda, we'll be in DRC Bukavu in the South Province in about 10 days. I like DRC vibe. Been checking you, your content. Yeah, yeah, I think DRC is fine. I've not been to the eastern side, but I'm told like the eastern side, uh, they speak Kiswahili and do a lot of things like East Africa. So I'm yet to visit the, I'm yet to visit the east side of DRC. Where are you watching me from? Hit the like button. Hit the like button. Hit the like button as you're coming in. And if you have any question, feel free to ask me. Feel free to ask your sister any question that you have. Mm, okay. 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 <laughs> Are you still going to Jamaica? Yes. Um I don't like I'm I'll still be going to Jamaica. Sorry. I'll still be going to Jamaica, but um, the month 
not yet decided which exact month I'll be in Jamaica. Um, I've not done research about the restrictions yet. So before I go to a country, right now, traveling right now is not like before where you could just go, yeah, especially if you know the country is visa-free. So right now traveling is a bit different. So I can't just go. I have to check. Do they have requirements, COVID requirements? I don't know, QR code and like I have to check all that. And it would be nice if I'm able to visit other countries in the Caribbean, uh, not just Jamaica. I visit Jamaica and other countries in the Caribbean. So I don't know. I don't know how that's going to be like. And it's going to be new territory for me. Like um, I kind of feel being in Africa, it's easier to travel despite the challenges easier in the sense that i feel like i don't know any anyway, i don't know how to explain it but yeah i would love to check out the countries in the caribbean i would love to check them out so if you have contacts if you want to you know i i i it's hard to go there without knowing or having contacts there so if you have any contacts any support for your sister it's highly welcome so that when i visit there i don't get lost uh, how is the weather in Addis Ababa cold? It's like Nairobi. Like, I find Nairobi to be cold. So I find Addis to be cold too. Because, in fact, Addis is, I think, because of the terrain of this place, Addis is very cold and dry. So even sometimes when the sun is out there, you still feel the cold. So it's cold and dry. And so it makes it, sometimes it's really tough for me because uh, I feel like my skin peels sometimes because of the weather. So I was asking my Ethiopian friends and Ethiopian girls, yeah, how, what do they use on their skin? Because my skin is kind of reacting or maybe it just needs time to adjust. But for some people who say, if you think Nairobi weather is perfect, then Addis is perfect. For me, I'm used to like warmer places like Mombasa, Kisumu, Lagos. That's my kind of weather. So if you don't like hot weather, then you'll find Addis perfect. Mm. Are you going to visit out of Addis? I'm out of Addis right now. I'm not in Addis Ababa right now. I'm out of Addis. I wish to visit Kenya one day. I just know many fellow Eritreans. Yeah, I have some Eritrean friends in Kenya. So, yeah. One day you have to go to Haiti. I don't have contacts there. Your glasses are nice. Thank you, Kwame. How are you doing? Jamaica has curfew right now. Okay. So, those are the kind of things I need to research before traveling. I wouldn't want to go to a country and get myself in some mandatory quarantine for $2,000 for 11 days when I'm supposed to be in the country for two weeks. So it wouldn't make any sense to me. Thank you so much, Dobie. Uh, I would love that skin. It's beautiful. Thank you. The biggest building in Nairobi is KICC. Not anymore. KICC used to be the, the, the tallest building, but right now I think there are taller buildings than KICC. Mm. Happy birthday, Yodit! It's, it's midnight. Happy birthday! I cannot come to your room right now, but let me. I, I, I wish I could sing. I could sing for you. So it's my friend's birthday. If you've been watching my videos, you've probably seen her. It's her birthday. Um, happy birthday! I come to your room. It's far. I have to go down the stairs. <laughs> okay, I'm coming. I'm coming. It's her birthday. Wish this beautiful girl a happy birthday. When are you going? Okay, I'm coming, girl. Let me just wear something. Uh, when are you going back to Kenya? I'm not very sure. I'll be going back to Kenya.
Kenya, I have an open ticket. So very soon or later, like, because um, I'm having some issues uh, with banking and accessing money here. So I'll definitely have to go back to Kenya to get that sorted out. So, yeah. Go down those stairs. I'm lazy. I'm lazy. She's making me do too much work. Anyway, let me get my earphones fast and my power bank because if this goes off, we'll need to charge it. I'm so lazy to go down those stairs, but it's her birthday, so. Ah, yes, it's very beautiful. Like, this camera and the internet cannot be able to fully capture the beauty of this place. But, let me go down to her room. Was, let me lock my door. Hit the like button. Let me know where you're watching me from. Caribbean is really nice. Tell your friend happy birthday. I'm heading there right now. I'm, I'm heading to her room right now. Mm. Hit the like button as you're coming in. Let me know where you're joining me from. Oh. Let me know where you're joining me from. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to her. Um, currently, Kenya is not uh, is on lockdown. Not what either way. Home is best. Yeah, home. I'm coming. I'm coming. Can you see me from this point? Yeah, I can see you. That's why I'm like, wait, come here. You're giving me too much work. Hey, it's my birthday. So, you, you think? You think because it's your birthday, you can order me around? <laughs> order me, but it's not order. <laughs> okay, so I'm coming. Yeah, but, yeah, wait one moment. It's, it's so that it's live. Yay, okay, now you are on. Yay, okay. you can come now. Okay. Yay. Are you live? Yes. Where? On Instagram. Okay. Please don't capture me as I'll be walking there. Hit the like button as you're coming in. Hit the like button. Hit that like button as you're coming in in case you have any question. Please, please don't show me yet. I have not covered myself very well. Shh, don't. You're going to show people things they don't need to see. Check me out. That also looks fabulous. Look at me. Happy birthday. Happy birthday to me. <laughs> Welcome to my humble home. Welcome. Uh, my friend got visa on arrival to Sudan from Kenya. Just got. Uh -huh. Look at that. She's also live. Oh, your camera is really nice. Look at this. When there are your, bath this is there your birthday wishes. Hold this for me. I, I, I need to be decent. Wow, this thing is like really heavy. Hello, everybody. Uh, you, where is your next planned trip? I don't have any planned trip yet. We have. Where? Where are we going? Uh, back to Addis. Back to Addis. <laughs> <laughs> Happy birthday, Ethiopian queen. Thank you, honey boo. Thank you very much. Would you like some water? Because that's all I can offer you at the moment. Yes, please. Because you made me walk the stairs. Um, you walked one so you there. need this place and to visit. There's going to be a lot of videos from this place. I mean, if you're planning to visit this place, you'll need to be here for more than... In order to fully experience it, you'll need like at least five days or one week. Mm. Tell your friend happy birthday. Happy birthday. Yeah, where is where? What? Happy. Oh, the lighting here, oh, it's clearer than mine. Yeah. Wait. Happy birthday to me. So to say happy birthday to me, you can come to my channel and subscribe. Happy Traveler. And um, yeah, you can send me gifts if 
Uh, here you go, my love. A uh, happy birthday to me. Here's your champagne. <laughs> and this is our champagne. We're gonna pop some bottles up in here. <laughs> okay, pop so I'm to put the. I hope you seated Wait. enough, decent enough. Yes. Okay. I don't want to flash anyone <laughs> with my beautifulness. <laughs> okay, so let me open the water. Um, Meleka, I'm told to tell you. Melikamili dead. Melikamili dead, yes. That what does that mean? Happy birthday. Happy, happy birthday. birthday. Thank you. Okay, send me gifts now. Not emojis, <laughs> freaking gifts. Send me money, <laughs> motherfuckers. Like, what the hell? <laughs> you did. What? I'm not talking to your people. I'm talking to my people. <laughs> they know how crazy I am. It's fine. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Happy birthday! Coming Someone has written in Amharic. I can't read that. Uh huh. What's that? Which what? Woo. That birthday and that's in Amharic. Happy Easter. Uh, where? 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 Are you? That one. Happy birthday, Malcolm Lidet. Malcolm Lidet. Malcolm Lidet. Oh. Malcolm Lidet means happy birthday in Amharic. Okay. Okay. Mm. Smash the like button as you're coming in. Happy Eastern. Uh, yeah, Happy Eastern to Happy all of the Easter. Thank you. European. Thank you, Kwame. Nagambula. Ah, Beautiful. which language is that? But, Show yeah. us the birthday cake. Here's the cake. <laughs> Someone's saying that I showed them the birthday cake. I'm like, you're the cake. Uh, I, am, <laughs> I am the cake. <laughs> I am the cake. I do look like a cake. I, this hair needs some some fixing dude <laughs> looks like a hat yeah that's that's the birthday cake yes i am the birthday cake mm -hmm. mm, happy Easter what is the name of this place you're ready to turn up uh i'll tell you after we leave here uh ever should send her a gift package for f everyone should send her a gift package for boston's day spa okay Someone, they say they need to send you a gift package for Boston Day Spa. Who said that? Mr. Dakas, the navigator. Oh, maybe they should make that in cash. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> I am very pretty. Uh, I pop up, this spa. Pop up some bottles of uh, fresh yes. water. No. Don't Cheers. Don't it water. It's champagne. Okay. It's champagne. We're popping bottles. Cheers! Don't make my party lame. <laughs> it's water. What do you wish for? What's your birthday wish? I I've been saying all night. Nobody's listening. I want you to send me money. <laughs> like I am not even joking around. I'm freaking serious. I don't want no birthday wishes, no birthday dinners, no you know like spa treatments. I get all of that, no problem. I know how to treat me. Send me the cash. I'll, I know what to do with it. Mm. And subscribe to my channel. Mm. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Happy birthday. You're so beautiful. Oh, there you go, honey. Uh, can I have a bite of the cake? Uh, which cake? This one? This one is a human being. We do not bite human beings. <laughs> it's illegal. <laughs> It's not good. <laughs> Why are you not yet married, African tigress? Because there have not been a sufficient, uh, educated, beautiful, and just a king enough man to marry this wonderful lady. <laughs> not yet. I'll not add anything to that. I'll not give my comment or opinion. Anyway. Can I ask you marriage in... No, no, no marriage requirements here, please. Where is the champagne? Right here. Here. Right here. These people are not paying us when we're advertising. Uh, man. I don't even know which brand is this. Oh, okay. It's just water. Wow. Yeah. Uh, joining the chat, the chat Can from. I ask for your hand in... No, nine. Can we see the room, please? If you check the beginning of the video later on, when you'll be rewatching it, you will see the view of the room. 
unfortunately right now it's not very clear so uh when i was doing the room tour people told me the footage was not clear and i stopped so yes, you'll see it here. you'll see it in very another nice. video I like, I like her hair. Natural. Someone, Thank you. Someone, someone was thinking that this is a wig. Ah, it's not. I told you, people drag my hair thinking it's wig. Someone tried to pull my hair thinking it's wig and almost drag me down to the ground. No. My mother gave me this hair. So no. Um hey sweetheart hello darling hey hey i'm a good guy ask african tigers uh, vince of africa is saying he wants to marry me mm -hmm. and uh, he said he you know him and that he's a good guy uh, but i don't know for some reason why people keep asking for marriage why what, what's happening they want yes. to marry you yes, is there polygamy in ethiopia is that like marrying more, more than one, one wife? It depends on the area. So there's areas in Ethiopia where polygamy is legal. In Nyangato. In Nyangato. <laughs> okay, so you can go to Nyangato for two wives. You can, you can, you can get 16 to 23 for wives if you want, if you have the money to maintain them. Thank you so much, David. How are you? Where is your next visit to my house? What is tomorrow? the birthday girl yeah, PayPal? What's your PayPal? Uh, my PayPal is yoditbella19 at gmail.com. Yoditbella19 at gmail.com. If you, you write it down over there. Yeah. Why? I can't. I'm not. I don't know how to type. Why? Come, if you go. Oh, you, are you live? Yes. Okay. I'm not. You could have typed it on my chat. Ah. Okay, when you you're done, you can type it. If you was married, can we would not you? have the privilege can of her travel. Yes. Maybe, maybe, Where but I don't want to ever stop traveling. So I'm not stopping traveling. Okay, have married or the not, I travel for life. Send you love, my dear and one moment, I'm just gonna write my PayPal to these people mm. because they actually want to send me some money for my birthday. And I Back really it, Mohammed says one African moment, Tigress is waiting for me. Mm. Hmm. Hey, it's me, Licking Nigeria. You look beautiful tonight. Thank you so much. Alaji. Oh, Alaji. Thank you so much. Uh, watching from Norway. Is that the one? What's, what's the one? Who is the one? Who is the one? Hit the like button. Let me know where you're joining me from. Hey there, you two. 21, 23, 21 here in Southern Africa. South Africa is one hour behind East Africa. So this East African girl just turned a year older today. I just post, I just sent you the email. Have it's you commented it? One. Have you have you posted it in the chat? Yes, it's Havisha Traveler One at gmail.com. I made a new one because the other one is private one. Is it working? Have you tried it? I didn't try it because I didn't put any money in it. So let's try it with that one. Yeah, let's try it with this one. Hi sister, how are you enjoying the African country vlogs? It's amazing. This girl needs to take me. Where? Everywhere, like you know, I like your videos, so those places. I'll take you anywhere you want, honey boo boo. And we fly away and go to beautiful places. I want to I want to go to the ville to outside, like you know, like to experience life beyond Addis. Well, you tell me when you're ready and we go, boo. Okay, when we but leave, you, you know, we'll... okay, next weekend. Uh, yeah, but uh, first we have to. So, Fix the, the, you know. Would love to see y'all in Kenya after this lockdown. I'm dragging her to Kenya, whether she likes it or not. No, I, I want to come. I, I really do. I'm waiting for my thing to be fixed. So when they send me my money, then I'll come. Okay. Will you guys travel to another African country together? 
Do you want to travel with me? Absolutely, honey boo boo. You know the answers. <laughs> no question about it. I'm still trying to figure this thing out. If not, wait. Why this thing? Okay, do this first. What? Comment on the video. Just write hi. And then I don't. Okay. I did write. Not write hi first without the email. Okay. Comment hi first. Uh, why in Nairobi hair salon expensive than Ethiopia? Nairobi, a lot of things are more expensive than Ethiopia. Like, not a lot. Um, yeah, a lot of things, a lot of things. So, cost of living in Ethiopia is a bit cheaper than Nairobi. So, hi Jackie, thank you so much. Uh, watching you guys from Zambia. How are you, Zambia? Love to Zambia. Uh, you're such an inspiration watching you from Canada. Thank you so much, V. Hi, Elias. Hey, Yenne Konjo Salam. What's that? I know Please, Konjo is beautiful. beautiful. Konjo, Konjo. Thank you. I said it right, right? I said it right, right? I'm a signal. Uh... uh I think I'll just put the one I normally use. I've not even seen any of your comments. Hey, okay, I just I just put hey. How did your queens meet? I just put hey. Habesha Travel is very brave. She has a video where she's in a boat near crocodiles. Her post is already visible. I can't see it. Okay, I've seen it. I've seen it now. Oh goodness, I've never streamed on my phone, so this is the first time, so I don't know. Because I don't think you are able to, to post a link or an email if you are not a moderator. But I don't know how to add from my phone, because I've never streamed on my phone. So Give me. Your room is open. Is it safe? This is actually not the room. This is the balcony. Oh, everybody. Everybody? Okay. What? Let me let me let me let me let me just show a little bit. So there's a bed on the balcony, but this is not the room is in there. Just have an extra bed on the balcony in case you want to have some view of the lake because there's a lake on that side. So this is just a place to rest. So Okay, so your email has posted Yeah, they've approved it. My moderators approved it. So the room is that one, the one that's closed. So this is just an echo. Uh, I like that balcony. I like it too. And the roofing. Uh, why? And the roofing. I like the roofing. Mm. <laughs> Serene, yes. What's her PayPal? Uh, I think the moderator has approved it. Yodit Bella one. No, Yodit Bella nineteen. So you have two PayPal's. Yeah, or Habisha Traveler one. It's All Gmail. those emails you've created PayPal accounts with. No, these two are. So the what? new one is Habisha Traveler one. That's the new one I just created because right. you told me to create a new one. Mm -hmm. But the old one is yoditbella19 at gmail.com. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Yoditbella19 at gmail.com. Yeah. Do you want me to write it? Yeah, write it. Honey, honey says, Kuriftu, I like it. <laughs> Don't forget, guys, to send the birthday girl, Bezu Gunz. What's that? Bezu Gunz, with lots of money. Oh, Mr. Dakas, you should lead. Uh, tell her I'm gonna propose on her next birthday. I'm so in love with her. Yemeke mem. What? Yemeke mem. I just subscribed to your channel yesterday from Canada and to Ethiopia 2019 twice. 
waiting for corona to vi- to finish corona is not gonna is this it's not gonna finish corona is not gonna finish i was it waiting for corona to finish a business last year i it didn't finish so i just said let's travel anyway so you're making ethiopia look good i think it is from my experience so far ah uh, dana dana na chu dana na dana na i'm sure i butchered the spelling no, though i had good. it from ida dana na chu mhm it's is organic food available in ethiopia everything is organic darling just like us organic <laughs> Don't panic, it's organic. Don't panic, it's organic. Don't panic, it's organic. <laughs> so don't panic, it's organic. You guys need to visit Victoria Falls. That's in Zambia. We will. Uh, hi from Congo. How are you doing? Hey, now people are fighting. Please, brother, she will be my wife. People are fighting for who's going to be your wife. Who's gonna be a blue bay? My booby? Bay. My booby. Your bay. Gonna be my. Stop. <laughs> gonna be my. Don't they? Are you Stop a me, kind? Buddy. Stop fighting. <laughs> uh, you are kind, our Kenyan sister. God bless you both. I'm yes. watching a vid, a Besha travel videos back to back. The educative, funny. Even those done in Amharic, I enjoy. Even though I do not know Amharic. Don't panic. It's organic. Yes. And because it's a birthday, it's gonna be party after birthday. Party after birthday. No, birthday after party. Birthday after party after party after party. You know, we're having this uh, b- this much blast and fun and party with, with water. water. Can you imagine if it was champagne? What's champagne? <laughs> champagne, babe. Champagne. Yes. In which language? Champagne is a brand, like a I good one. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I don't take alcohol. <laughs> I only this is my alcohol. This is my alcohol. So you drink more than me. Yeah, of course I've drank a lot of water more than you. So. <laughs> <laughs> um there is no competition at all she's definitely my soulmate oh, oh la la. tigress would you ever feed the hyenas with raw meat oh, yeah bless yeah. you you do that yes where in harar i did that twice you'll take me there i'll take you there as long as they don't eat me that's ah, just hyenas babe you'll be fine Hyenas eat people. And they're huge, man. They're huge. They eat people. Like, I've seen hyenas, like, uh, here and other places. They're not that big. But the ones in Harar, that the ones you feed, they're huge. They're really big. For some reason, they're very big. But they're, they're friendly. I mean, they didn't eat me. I'm still alive. And I fed a few of them, so. I don't like joking with this life. I only have one. I need myself alive. True. True. Someone says, tell her to shake her hair like Alicia Keys. That's the first entertainer I seen do that live. Do you shake your hair? What? What is that? I don't that know. Mean? Like this? I don't know what that means. Thank you so much, Seraphine. Yeah, thank you so much for the super chat. Ha 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 ha. Magna Magna Garma new me wedaderu. What's that? Can you read that? Okay. <laughs> Are you able to I understand? I did not understand really. I understood mewadadero, it means competition. But come, come and. Oh, this is the ones who are talking about you being their wife. 
Uh -huh. So that's the competition, okay. Habesha Traveler strikes me as a naughty in a funny way, in a fun way. Hi, Med Knowledge. How are you doing? The Ethiopian Higher Strikes videos. A uh, bless up Jamaica. Who is the new friend beside you? She's pretty funny. She's Habesha Traveler. You've probably seen her in almost all my Ethiopian videos. So if you're not watching my videos, I don't know why you're not watching. Bless up, brother. Wagwan. Megnag. Menegma Saferna Magananya Ah Magananya That's near your uh, place What's that? Magananya is an area mm -hmm. It's like a neighborhood mm -hmm. So He's saying Magananya Saferna Manu To Who? mean what? Who is in Magananya? Maybe he He's telling you he's there uh, salam alaikum from Jamaica, soldier. Wagwan, wagwan, wagwan. <clears throat> wagwan, when do we go to Jamaica? Uh, any day. Any day. Let's go tomorrow. Okay. Ah. Pack the bags. Bags oh. are packed. Okay, I'm ready. Let's go. Book I'm the flight. I'm ready. I'm broke. I can't <laughs> go anywhere. <laughs> I will come when I can afford it. Okay. <clears throat> Hit the mm -hmm. like button, hit the like button. If you have any question to ask, feel free to ask. It's our bath, it's a birthday weekend getaway. And today, just at midnight, was my birthday. It is, it's not was. Why are you speaking about past You said tense? was. That's what I said. Okay. It, I actually, I just turned, it just turned my birthday at midnight. So today's my birthday tomorrow is my birthday and the whole freaking month is my birthday because i'm going to celebrate it like a festival because i'm very happy that i'm born yes there you have it <laughs> oh he's like i'm from magna but living in zambia cash up tell them to pay yeah i don't have cash up cash up doesn't work in africa so we don't have cash up uh salam i stay in kasumambelasa border between congo and zambia okay yes i have birthday month too <laughs> those ones who celebrate their birthdays the whole month you are both welcome to jamaica yay thank you I love you. We love you too. <laughs> hey, T Success Nation, how are you doing? Happy to see you after years, ages. Who that? Your friend? My my friend. I'm lying. It's just a couple of months, but <laughs> it feels like years. Save to go to Jamaica to Bob Marley's birthday. You won't regret it. Ooh, that sounds like a really good plan. I would love that. Money follow us. <laughs> I know. <laughs> when money I will mean, follow I, us. I, absolutely. If I can afford it, I would definitely go. Mm -hmm. But at the moment, uh, Corona has not been very kind to me. So I don't think I'll be going anywhere anytime soon. Mm -hmm. But definitely, if I can afford it, I would definitely come. Okay. Thank you so much, Success Nation. Someone says your pay new PayPal doesn't accept payment. Oh, but what about uh, uh, the old one? Which is you, the old one? The old one is Yodit Bella, which is Y O D I T B E D -L, L A 19, as in 19, at gmail.com. Yeah, try that one. Let me clean the lens. I think the lens is a bit. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Okay, we're back. Mm. Hey, sisters, I'm new to your channel. What, where, what area are you both now? In Ethiopia? Mm. Internet connection is good, so it means your room has better internet connection than mine. Yeah. Because okay. on the other side, people were saying that the internet wasn't good. Mm. 
I'm trying to link my fingerprint here. It's not working. So Someone much. says, technically, it's not your birthday till morning. Time is different in Ethiopia. No, it's already midnight. Who said that? What's... Oh, like, Ethiopian time is different? So you start it's, counting in the Ethiopian calendar or whatever, Ethiopian time. Do you start counting time in the morning? Well, it's midnight. Midnight means it's another day already. Okay. So when you're even fasting, mm -hmm. you can even break your fasting at midnight. Oh. So I don't know where this... Your birthday tomorrow? No, today it has already started. My birthday started already. Cash App works in Africa? Where? Like, I downloaded Cash App on my mobile and it says not supported in region. In fact... If you want to download Cash App, you have to use VPN. If you search for it on Play Store, uh, you won't get it because it's not supported in the region. So if you know how it works, let me know. Go to Shashamene first. You've been to Shashamene? I have, but for what? Hi, African Tigress. You two are chilling in here. Yes, say it again. Uh, Yodit Bella 19 Yes. At gmail.com. Yeah, she's written the new one. Sema tigress, yani, ni kuwenzoi pekenu, mazesi ukuze tu. It's 10.39 p.m. in the UK. Salio to Ethiopia. Ramadan coming soon, inshallah. Inshallah. They use cash up in Gambia. Maybe it's just for some countries. I mean, if someone was living in America and they go to gambia it would work america uk or wherever and they go to gambia or or even if they're in kenya it would work but if you are kenyan without the your details your and details or whatever details in america uk or countries that allow uh cash up it won't work it only works for people who are living in america and they moved to Africa because they already had it. So it would work if you already have it. The same way super chat would work in a country that is not super chat enabled. Like Ethiopia is not super chat. Actually, Ethiopia is not monetized on YouTube, right? No, that's why I'm having difficulties trying to get paid from them. Yeah, so actually if you're ethiopian and you create your channel in ethiopia ethiopia does not have youtube partnership programs so if you are ethiopian youtuber you you have to create your channel outside ethiopia in order for your channel to get monetized good night from addis my african queen I enjoy thank you so much honey good night love are you going to celebrate in the nightlife later in for your birthday? Of We've course already, we are. We are. That's we are, what we're doing. We already started it. This is what we're doing. This is our nightlife at the moment. We're with you, partying <laughs> in this beautiful spot. We've got our drink. Mm -hmm. You know, we've got each other. We mm -hmm. got you. This Abdi wanna you know, someone says party. someone says Abdi wanna nice peke manze awataki kijana firauni maze hey vijana kazienu ni ngumu metushinda metushinda oh, tufanye yeah, nini so, sasa but, <laughs> what does that mean hmm? what does that mean yeah, someone saying that we are just enjoying our we are enjoying alone we don't want men absolutely um, <laughs> Uh, thank you so much, Kamar Modi. He sent me uh, money. Thank you. Thank you. This this is actually my first birthday present. So thank you very much. I really appreciate it. And I will definitely save it and put it in a good use and make a beautiful video out of it. Bueno, with you know, with more, I'll put more money on it and then go somewhere and make a nice video with it. So thank you very much for, uh, yeah, for sending me money. Uh, very exciting. I've never had anybody send me money before. Oh, this is nice. This is 
was the first time anybody ever sent me money, so that's kind of cute. How are they able to send in beer? Oh, it's, no, it's not, not in, in beer, beer, it's, it's in, in euros. euros. Because oh. my, my thing receives in euros. Oh, awesome. Yeah. Uh, me either you can recommend a good butcher in Addis that will cook the meat after they cut it. I don't know what that. Oh, and Kumfe, Kumfe also sent me. Wow, yay! Thank yeah. you. Not two people send me K money. Sete, that's called Sete. No, it's a uh, Kumfe Gabriel Gete. Thank you so much. Yay! Mwah, 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 mwah. Love you guys. Yeah, I got two birthday presents. This is amazing. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Um, I'm trying to see this. I can't see. Happy birthday. Thank you. I reckon no. I can't read that. I reckon no one did it. What does that mean? He's asking you for drinking arake. Arake is a traditional drink. Uh, mm -hmm. That's more like uh, uzo for the um, in the modern one. Mm -hmm. um, so he thinks like, and it looks like water, you know. And people put it in a bottle like this to drink it. Mm -hmm. So he's saying, is it that okay? You guys are drinking? Yeah, I mean, if it makes you feel better, it is absolutely. Showcase some Ethiopian opals before leaving. Okay, so you got money from uh, the sea. Uh, and Mesha says, Habesha Traveler, check your email. And I also think v African Blood sent you some money. Oh, really? Yeah, Let I think see. two people have sent you money. Yeah, but we just thank them. Yeah, so I'm, re I'm getting the notification fleet. I have an uh, amazing strategy to further monetize your channel. How do I get in contact? The African Tigress at gmail.com. My email is always, always in the description. Uh, see, she about to get paid. Keep her clothes, African tigress. That's your personal. No, she's not my personal assistant. She's my friend. <laughs> mm, have you? Ever... No problem. I can be a personal assistant sometimes, but then I'll just be like, "Wow." <laughs> have you visited Djibouti before? Not yet. Have you? Uh, not yet, but it's on the plan, and I was actually planning something, and mm -hmm. we'll see how it goes. I wish you had, you had shown more of the resort. Have a great time. I will let you know when I make Africa. I make it to Africa again. Maybe our path will cross. You'll seem to make a great travel companion. Are these videos coming about that? These videos about the resort and the place, all that. It's just that the connection is not so good right now. But if you can see, how clear is it? Mm -hmm. How clear is the video if from your end when you check it? It's clear. It's clear? Yeah, it Good. is. Yeah, from your place. So this is basically the view of the resort. This is at the balcony. Don't worry, I'm not going <laughs> to. No, I'm just scratching. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just itchy. <laughs> Okay, so this is the view of the resort. This is the side. Do I show your room? Yeah, go for it. It's a bit dark inside though. It's a bit only... dark, but we can turn on the light. Ah. Show them this beautiful bed. This is nice. Okay, she's there. On the balcony. Oh, I have a YouTube channel called Habisha Traveler. If you're not there, come. Come <laughs> and say hello. And this is the balcony. There's a lake out there, but you can't see it because it's dark. Show them the beautiful chandelier. It's seen. That's it. But it doesn't pick the colors because of the light. I think you will not go back to your country. I also don't think so. <laughs> it's not going anywhere. I'm keeping her with me. So this is the room. I don't even know where the light is. How do I turn on the light in your room? Wait, your room looks a bit different than mine. No, because I closed everything. So the mosquitoes. mosquitoes. That's what I mean about the lighting is much better. Oh, you don't have the chandeliers on the side. Oh. But, like, um, maybe I can put this light for you if it makes a bit more light. Which one? Only that? Like this, maybe. 
Okay. So let me just put this. Like this. Is it more visible? Uh, a little bit. But basically, this is how the place looks like. That, that. Some beautiful chandeliers. I get to know what you are saying about the lighting. Yeah, I told you. Like, how about now? Does it help? A little bit. But, yeah. Yeah. Hello there, hi there. So basically, this is how the place looks. Uh, very beautiful. Yes, it is. Save the enjoyment for our honeymoon. Okay, you did we hear that? Mm, I'm in Cape Town, next stop Ethiopia. You should. You guys are doing a great job. I like it. Thank you so much. Please, whenever you're watching the videos, hit the like button. You know, it helps. I mean, it's the little contribution that you can do. Just hit the like button and if you are in a position to share my videos, please. Mosquitoes. I've not had any mosquito bites since I came. No, not yet. Maybe tomorrow. Maybe. No, they're gonna, they won't bite me. Whenever you're watching my videos, please, please, just share and always hit the like button hit the like button it's the little you can contribute okay so i don't know if there's any other question any question this person said you save the enjoyment for your honeymoon you did what you said save the enjoyment for your honeymoon i am in my honeymoon <laughs> with me and my honey boo Happy birthday. Thank you. I was the you. first to wish you. No, you weren't. I was screaming outside. At when night. you screamed, I, I was, was the first to No, I screamed. I screamed. You wouldn't hear me. So I'm like, okay, she's on live. And then I went back to bed. And then I came back out. Mm -hmm. And I kept again. And then you guys started calling me when I went back to bed. And I came out. Because I was also on live on instagram i was live on instagram oh okay so i waited until it was midnight and then i said happy birthday to me to myself and then i was next no i you there were more people physically you're the first at least you're spending the birthday weekend with me yeah, that's more important my <laughs> that's more important they're just online <laughs> <laughs> They're just online and we're here. Yes. Birthday yes. girl sing, I'll put money on your forehead. Put the money on the forehead first. Yeah. Exactly. Put the money on the forehead. I will sing. Happy birthday. A song of your choice. Of course. What's your Instagram? My Instagram is African Tigress at Kenyan Sister. Her Instagram is Habesha Traveler. No, sir. What, sir? No, I don't know what that is. No, sir? S A A A A H. No idea what that means. But I think it's like, nah, something like this. I must slide into your DM. Get ready. Someone's gonna slide into your DM. Unless you're sliding some type of money, you don't try to slide any. <laughs> Trying to marry. Ooh, what's this? What? Mm? <laughs> what the fuck is that? You. What's that? <laughs> Some message here. I don't know. Hey, Sarah Justice. How are you doing, sis? It's been long since I last communicated or saw you on my streams. How have you been? here with me look how fabulous we are right now here in the in this beautiful uh, <laughs> give me my water what are you doing with <laughs> what are you putting my water come on now <laughs> look at us so much 
such light, so bright and beautiful. Oh my goodness. Mm -hmm. Oh my goodness. Goodness me gracious. Goodness me gracious. Aki Kenya is boring. Oh, you just read it so well. You know what that means? Aki Kenya. Aki is an expression to mean just like for real. Damn, all money, no honey. <laughs> That's honey, you. I am giving you so much honey on my channel with so much educating videos, so much fun, so much entertainment. So it's my birthday and it's your turn to give something to me. So yeah, that's all I got to say to you, Elias. Yeah, veins of African blood. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay this is beautiful thank you so much you're being missed in kenya oh, i don't think the lockdown really misses me what? like <laughs> like the lockdown is my biggest problem of course i miss kenya i miss like i don't know i miss kenya so much i miss kenya too and i never been there yeah i've been away from kenya since january so it's really hard, but then thinking about going to lockdown and they saying that Kenya is on third wave of COVID, I don't want to. <laughs> oh, okay. Okay. Uh, a page called mm -hmm. Jafar Muhammad mm -hmm. likes my page. Mm -hmm. Your friend has beautiful energy. What a beautiful life. I'm so in love with that place. Thank you. There's so much things to give. That's the person who was saying that the one who's no money, no, no honey. They say this. So. Anyway. Uh, hello, African Tigress and a better traveler. Hi, Leah. How are you doing? Um, I'm sure Mekula Njera, how Jachoka. I love injera by the way interestingly i love injera i love it like the first time i ate injera about three years four four years ago i didn't like it at all i was like oh my goodness and i'd i'd actually got to addis like was it my first time in addis or second time in addis so when i got to addis and everybody had been talking about how injera is great that night I got around 11 p.m. So where I was staying at the hotel, I requested they serve me injera and lamb, whatever. I, that's what was available. I regretted it. I didn't eat. I slept hungry that day. Just on juice. I just took juice and slept. And I said I will never order it again. But then uh, there's a friend of mine in Kenya who was an Ethiopian uh restaurants i've been going there a couple of times trying it right now i love it like i love injera so much tibs we eat a lot of injera in canada hey seko addisis happy birthday african queen thank you hi tigress hi malaika how are you doing honey uh curry goat yummy uh i want to come to ethiopia for the women what's your t when someone say they want to come to ethiopia for the women uh they're trying to find the wife i'm guessing mm -hmm. ethiopia girl your english is well there's a difference between injera in kenya and injera in ethiopia i've had both and it depends in kenya it depends where you're gonna have that in jera i mean for me at my friend's restaurant the injera there and in jera here no big difference because how they make it how they learned it and all that it's through ethiopia they've been here they lived here uh um my name is tigress kindly not tiger <laughs> 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 we have changed it to Ambesa. Okay, she calls me Ambesa, Ambesit. Ambesit? Apparently, a, tig a tigress or tiger in Amharic is Neba. Never. Never. Uh 
We love you, Yodi. Happy birthday. Thank you. Mwah. Happy Easter, Tigress, to you and your friend. Thank you, Malaika. I just had brown stew chicken breader. Mzuri for sure. For sure, for sure. Uh, happy Easter, everyone. Uh, is that train? No. Wind. Yeah, it's wind. What It'll they used so to nice. make in Jera is the difference. They get their sauce. They sauce whatever they used to make in Jera from Ethiopia. So they have everything. All the, whatever they get, they source them from Ethiopia. I love a Besha traveler. Love you. There's mom. a message for you. Uh, but I'm more dish very chilling. I'm the Yanish, but I'm a mess again. I'm leaning with the Xavier accurately. Thank you. Uh, it's time, it's time to visit Gonda. When are you taking me to Gonda? Uh, when you want, love. When you want. Have a seat. Have a seat. Uh-huh. One Africa. Hi, guys. Hey, Cassidra. How are you doing? Karuni. I don't know what that is. And uh, Kwande Nametashi. Um, Kwande Nametashi is welcome. Uh, Hmm. I need to master that one. Equandenameta. Oh, can I flex in my little knowledge of Arabic? Please do. I'm from Nigeria. What's up? What's up? Uh, Cassidra. Hey, it was a pleasure. I must leave now. Thank you so much, Island Girls. Let me flex a little bit. So I now know how to count in Amharic. So I think I can count from one. To 999. She's not told me what a thousand is. She, so I can. She and she. And she. And she. She is thousand. Then she. And is one. Oh, and, oh, and, and she. she. Will it she? So it's she. Okay, okay. So let me flex a little bit in my uh, Amharic. So, and one. Who let two sauced three a rat four arms five seedist six sabbat seven uh, cement eight zetane nine asr 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 ten <laughs> good girl so some places in Ethiopia that are called by numbers, a rat kilo, mm -hmm. that's four. But I don't like it when people call it four kilo. Just say a rat kilo sounds better than four kilo. Hayahulet is 22. So with that, I can count one to 1,000. So if I'm saying 119, I won't say 119, I'll just say one, one, so I'll say, and, and, Zetane. <laughs> Good girl. <laughs> <laughs> She's doing amazing. She learned very fast and her, her accent is really good, so it's good. Mm -hmm. That was super birthday to you yesterday, Habesha. Actually, it's not yesterday, so if you turned, okay, the what do you mean yesterday? The birthday, the birthday date is tomorrow. 5th. Yeah, my birthday 5th is April. Yeah. So at midnight, it became 5th of April. So my birthday just started. Habesha Traveler, take African tigress to your family in Southern Gonda. Ish. Bidias, you have to promise. <laughs> Look, the camera is on your face, so you have to promise. You have to promise. You there is no me. promise. We don't know what's going to happen tomorrow. Take me there tomorrow. Let's go. Tomorrow but, is my birthday. Okay, tomorrow after the birthday. Tomorrow is my birthday. We do what I want. What I want. After the birthday. Home. After the birthday, we go. I'm proud to be Ethiopia. Very nice. Let's hear Malimi. I don't know Mawalimi. <laughs> Mawalimi is teacher. She's saying they want to hear me like the numbers I was counting. Ah, Abnen, go best Abnesit. Abnesit, much love. Mwah. 
what do you think about ethiopia very beautiful very relaxing it's like weekend every day like that's how i describe it it feels like weekend every day so it's a good thing and it can be a bad thing it can be a bad thing because you might become too comfortable. comfortable and i think you've not i'm not making some i need to be more serious i need to be more serious in my videos i'm not making as much videos because i'm having I'm so much of a good time <laughs> i'm trying to have a life <laughs> i'm trying to have a life beyond no but that's videos. Good. so uh i'll be serious i think next week i'm gonna give you five videos or four videos yeah but i'm not probably going to do the daily videos because i'm trying to have a life too uh, good night, then her Good night, it means you did it. Yeah, Wait. what's the next countries in the 21 countries? Somaliland, I think, Ethiopia, the land where all gods love to be. Keep on much love. Thank you, content time. Are uh, you ladies look so relaxed? Yes, your return. Are you coming to Kenya when the lockdown thing is over, right? Yeah. Oh, someone says your Amharic pronunciation is very good yeah, and good. understandable. Did you practice prior to coming to Ethiopia? No, I actually remember that day when you came that place where we were with mm -hmm. my friend in Bole that day when you were going to do the fittings for the fashion show. Uh -huh. Just that time when we were sitting there, that's when he taught me how to count. That's good. Yeah, just in that time when we were just sitting there, that's when he taught me how to count one to... 100 i want to see what's that i want to see her sleeping on medev what's that uh, he wants to see you sleeping on the floor that's yes. you not me no they already see me sleep on the floor i always sleep on the floor that's this is actually something they never see me do is sleep on a nice pet <laughs> why because i'm always sleeping on the floor you know like in some you know countryside somewhere <laughs> you know working in the farm some type of shit like that uh -huh. and they have never seen me in a fancy place like this so that kind of became my thing <laughs> what you don't like <laughs> someone is asking what don't you like at ethiopia if anything anything what would you like to change most restaurants most hotels you order food they take too long is that your experience i'm too used to it so you are like... used to it so for me i feel like hey you can die waiting for food <laughs> I, was, I was expecting you to say something else that's one thing i'll mention two things i don't like what i don't like is the hotels they take the restaurants you can wait for 45 minutes or one hour you're like like it's like when you make the order that's when they go to prepare it i i really don't know why it takes too long sometimes you can even run late waiting for food my friend there's a friend of mine um she had to walk out of her hotel because they were taking too long to serve the food um that's one thing i would love to see change second thing do i be honest <laughs> yeah because like, you're just talking crap right now I'm like, <laughs> do i be honest or you're gonna catch feelings i mean but it's my experience it's the truth um there's one thing about ethiopia um you don't want to come <laughs> i will save you i will save you Let it go. Ah, i'll say it in a few let me see the comments are uh, you are not allowed to have far alive give us more beautiful content pay me <laughs> you pay me if i'm gonna work all through then you gotta pay me otherwise let me try and have a life um, to join into the chat late, how has your day been at the hotel so far? Amazing, love it. Have a blessed night, ladies. You're the best. Yes, two beautiful queens. Yes, pay her. I have a question for a Besha traveler about the internet in Addis. Please ask her uh, if I could reach her. 
about internet in Addis, if I could reach her via email. Question about the internet in Addis. They want to reach out to you about the question via email. You want email. to reach me question about internet. Wouldn't that be better to reach out telecom? ETO Telecom. Because I have no idea about the internet. I buy it from the ETO Telecom. Yeah, there's just... Is it the only company providing internet here we in Ethiopia? We only have ETO Telecom. Yeah. Actually, it's, it's kind of good that there's only ETO Telecom because when there is more companies, you know, like they're kind of fighting to for the network so they don't really put more satellites or something but this is like the government and they have to share the same satellites i don't think so i think yeah, yeah, yeah. i think the more the companies providing you with the internet the cheaper the cost companies but, will have it faster yeah I but think like so. if you go to for example like some other countries in the countryside or you go to the mountain when I'm in the countryside, I have internet, mm -hmm. you know, but I go to some other places and there is no internet and they have more, more uh, companies, suppliers, you know, mm, maybe you should come to Kenya. Maybe we need to take lesson from Kenya because when I was in other places and I mean, I don't want to mention countries because people get a little bit, you know, mm -hmm. so uh, when I go to places like uh, three sites or something, the internet doesn't work or it's too slow. But in when I was uh, in the countryside, it worked, mm -hmm. you know, and in the mountain, it worked. Okay, someone says, uh, someone is asking how much is a thousand shillings? That's half. So a thousand shillings is about a thousand Kenyan shillings is like 500 beer. It's half. So if you have 1,000 beer, you have 2,000 Kenyan shillings. Although I feel like the currency here has depreciated because yeah. when I was here in 2018, 2018, I think it was like 20, 26 beer to $1. Right now it's like 40 something or 50 there about to $1. Less than a year ago, $1 was 30 something beer and now it's 40 something beer. Mm hmm you know like and less than less than 10 years ago one dollar was 10 bir. less than one year ago less than 10 years ago oh less than 10 years ago yeah yeah yeah, yeah. so it's depreciated so much yeah. and uh so which one is what which one is what i how do people calculate the word of a currency i was told it's not about the exchange rate the worth of a currency i really don't know but if it's about the exchange rate, then it would be the Ethiopian. Because uh, one Ethiopian beer would be equivalent to two Kenyan shillings. Watching you from Jamaica. Um, you having fun? Yes, we are. Develop on urban areas to maximize their profit, but the shilling has more buying power. Yeah, so I don't know. I don't know about the value of currency and all that because someone says the shilling has more power, buying power than the beer. I don't know about that. Yeah, no idea. Me neither. Did they fully stop accepting the old ETB banknotes? Yes. Yeah, actually, when I came here, last time when I was in Ethiopia, I think in 2018, I did have some beer. So when I came back this time around, I was like, oh, at least I have some money. I can get a taxi or ride somewhere to go get some money. Then when I arrived at the place, I gave the driver. Ooh. You know, just remember, anyway, anyway, I gave the driver the old beer and he said the money doesn't work anymore. I'm like, oh, when did, when did they change the money? Um, almost like five months ago or something, something like that. Uh-huh. Uh, Habesha Traveler, put your phone away and chill with us. He... I'm editing, my love. I am editing for you to put on my YouTube channel. So since this is her live, I am letting her have her moment with her people. And I'm here when you have a question. 
I are you am, single? I am editing. Is your friend single? Are you single? I am married to me. She's married to herself. It means you can use the currency different countries. I think it shows the power. Okay. What's that? It's the wind moving door. Don't worry. No, I just remember this. Are you shit to the wind? <laughs> <laughs> what is? Who Salam. You? Who invited you to my birthday party? <laughs> you don't have more words. So I get out of here. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I just remember this time when we came. Oh, that time when we came was up, and I was like, Oh my god, that was <laughs> like that was creepy. Uh, she's married to herself. To stay in the countryside. I'm coming to Ethiopia in two months to stay in the countryside. You will love it. I think so. I don't have not stayed in the countryside here. She knows better. Yes. You will love it. Mm -hmm. Oh, that must be a croc from the lake. A crocodile from the lake has come oh, for then the if birthday. If it's a crocodile is invited. Hello, croquet. Hey, Crocky. Welcome to the party. He doesn't even need our water. He has, yes, the the lake. he has the lake, so yeah. Someone says it's your man at the door. It's my man. Mr. Croc. Yes. Um. That's where my family is in the village. I was born there. Hi, Lady Sheila. Hi, Sheila from Ireland. How are you doing? Special looks from this. Uh, what's that? You're going to lose a day sleeping Easter Monday, US. You know, Addis is open business. Our Easter, May. yes, Ethiopian Easter is different. It's in May. I'll be here for the Easter chant of Church Kidisa. I don't know what that is. Church Kidisa. Okay, we're gonna be chant of uh, it's the you see the 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 chants and the singing mm -hmm. of the church. Oh, that's at this time. Oh, so they can hear it. Yeah, it's actually key down at this moment. But what 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 is it? What's that like? Uh, is it's a prayer? Is it which church? Orthodox. Orthodox. So is it a daily thing? No, it's not a daily thing. It must be something special. I don't know what day it is today. Today is on Sunday. No, no, I mean, like, in, in a number. Oh, yeah, today when we were coming from Addis, that big church in Bole, they had a lot of... There is some holiday, that's why, like, it's because at this time, because it started early, it started around 9. And I was like, why is it, like, uh, it's so early? Because even Kidan starts around 2. So this was, this is something special, I don't know what's happening. Yeah, when we were coming from Addis, that big church in Bole. Yeah, with Adam? Yes, I think the one close to Skyline. Yeah, they had some Ethiopian flag pieces of cloth. Ah, uh, it's Medhani Alam. Today's Medhani Alam. I was born in Medhani Alam. Uh, Medhani Alam is another name for Jesus. Uh huh. So it, today's Medhani Alam. So that church is Medhani Alam Church, and that's why it's Medhani Alam today. What does that mean? It means uh, Jesus Day. Yes, twenty-seven, like on Ethiopian calendar, it's twenty-seven. The twenty-seven uh -huh. is Medhan Elim Day. Okay. So it's that that day is where we celebrate Jesus, or I don't know how to explain it in in, um, in English, but yes, today is Medhan Elim, and I was born in a day of Medhan Elim. Okay. Yes. I was in Ethiopia, that door. I was in Ethiopia two years ago, enjoy every minute of my holiday, especially the traditional dance. Yeah. Ati amejiwa mwenyewe dunia kuisha na kwambia utajionea, utajionea na bado. They say, I don't even know how to translate that. Na bado utajionea. I just ordered Ethiopian coffee. It's amazing. It is. Thanks, Abesha. We are proud. 27. It's daily thing during the first time, a better traveler. 
Thank you so much. Destroy them. Thank you so much for the super chat. What's that? He said it's Deborah's Day today. Today is Deborah's Day. 27 is Deborah's Day. I didn't know that. Well, thank you for. Deborah's Day is know. what? Deborah's Day is where we are, but I didn't know it was the Tawot. So Deborah's Day means what? Deborah's Day. I guess it's Tawot as well. I don't know how to explain Tawot to you. Tawot is an ark. Like, you know, the thing that we put here. Okay, so they today's Deborah's Eight. Yeah, to, he said today's Deborah's Eight, but from what I know, it's Medhania Elem 27, it's Medhania Elem. But I mean, I guess I learned something new today, so. And I uh, think you destroyed them. What has, has they written? Have they written in uh, See? Your friend looks like a minister. Minister means what? Minister? Like a prime minister? A presidential minister you. or minister like the church minister? Oh, you're like church minister. Yeah, but if he's talking in Amharic, then he's saying you look like a minister. You. No, you like a minister, but a political minister, I think. Because it doesn't make any I look, sense. I look rich. Yes. I look I'm rich guessing. and fat. Conversations would come up. I oh. look rich and fancy. <laughs> anyway, what time is it in Ethiopia? Past midnight? I don't know. Probably one or two. What time is it? It is uh, one twenty. Uh huh. What's the corona situation in Ethiopia? In Europe, it's a nightmare. Uh, with all the restrictions in Ethiopia, you must wear a mask everywhere. Otherwise, you risk three years in jail. So yeah. Habesha, uh, are the hubs like Simos, Nero leaves? Are there hubs like that? What is that? Do you have Simos? What is that? I don't know. Nero leaves? What is that? Readily available in Addis. What about Haboti? I don't know. Maybe they are. But what, what are they? I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know. There are Simos, you Simos. Nero leaves are Nero leaves. Probably. I don't know. <laughs> You're just repeating the name. <laughs> yeah, because I don't. It's. Simos is Simos. Well, what is Simos? Tell us, Askari, <laughs> what is Simos? Thank you. Uh, savior of the Deborah's it means directly translated, it means savior of the world. So Jesus Christ at the end of the, the oh, world. Oh, so it's the same. Yeah. Yeah. I subscribe to you, African Tigress, because of Abesham Traveler. Yay! Thank you. Welcome to the club. Yay. Always hit the like button whenever you're watching. Uh, translate to Save of the World. Also tell Abesham Traveler that today is also Debra's 8. Yes, De I just De learned that today. in Debra's 8. Yeah, we are in Debra's 8. That's yes, why so we're, we're De hearing this uh, church uh, prayers then. Okay. Because we are in Debra's 8, and it's from Debra's 8 church, I'm guessing. So thank you for teaching me that because I did not know about the Brazil. It's meaning. African tigress. Why don't you make Ethiopian hairstyle? We will try. We but will you, try. No, we will. But you know, inside this hair, there's locks. What do you mean? My hair is locked. Why? Like yeah. lock. I thought it was uh, braided. It's it's braided locks. Mm. So there are locks inside, and then there's braid on top. So I don't know if that would really come out good. So we'll try and see if it works. <clears throat> Jumbo, I'm married to you, to you too. How does that work? Elias has been insisting on getting married to you. Mount Olive Mark, at the coming of Jesus Christ, the end of the world, uh, we celebrate early. The Brazil is a mountain in Israel. The Brazil is also a region in Ethiopia, I think. Um, I think it's because it's named after the, the mountain. That makes sense. Mount Olive, where God prayed. Habariyako Mzurisana is in the present Mount Olive. Okay. 
uh, too much water. The present is where we celebrate. We celebrate. So, is there like a big festival in this city? Like maybe tomorrow? I'm guessing it is. I think. Or was it today? Really nice. No, no, no. It's going to be tomorrow. It's going to be tomorrow. Yes, because the prayers continue now, and then the morning finishes, then there's more prayers, and then I think it's tomorrow. So it's gonna be like a big celebration here. I'm guessing. So we can try to go and check it out. What year is it in Ethiopia? 2013. Uh, I don't feel like leaving you girls, but I have to go bed. It's late here in Romania. It's uh, M. Enjoy your birthday. May the Almighty bless you. Thank you so much, David. We appreciate your time. Yeah, thank you, David. And it's the same. Th I, I didn't realize Ethiopia and Romania had the same time. Oh, oh yeah. Okay. It's just like a 10 minutes difference. Okay, Simos is a weed. You hear? Simos is a weed. It's a seaweed. A seaweed. Oh, I love seaweed. I miss seaweed. Simos is an Afrostidia drink. I don't I know. No idea. No, seaweed is like from from the ocean, right? Yeah. The ocean, yeah, the plant from the ocean. You have it? No, because we don't have ocean. They don't have an ocean. Ethiopia is a landlocked country, bordered by Eritrea, Djibouti, Somaliland, Somalia. Kenya, Sudan, and South Sudan. We are morning Jamaica style. Nettle tea is summer in Amharic. You have it? Summer. What's summer? She says, he says, I don't know if it's he or she. Nettle tea is same in Amharic as tea. Uh, it's summer. It's called summer. S A M A. Summer. Ah, summer. No, we don't drink. We have summer, but we don't drink it. You know, like our our parents used to beat us with it when we were being naughty. I mean, I didn't get beat with that, but you know, I've seen. <laughs> uh, enjoy Ethiopia. Hello from Gambia. Thank you for joining us. I wish I was there. No celebration. It is fasting season. I know. Are you going to but Sodor? We are celebrating. Look at this one. Are you going to Sodore? Sodore? No, we're not going to Sodore. Yes. <clears throat> so Ethiopia is in co <laughs> yes, So in Ethiopia it's COVID-13. COVID <laughs> so it will be COVID-12 because it's one year behind. No, COVID-11. COVID-11. <laughs> Actually, it's COVID-11 in Ethiopia. Yeah. Yeah, because it turned, we do not, we took the COVID vac. Who took the COVID vaccine? Not me. You took? No. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think there is it. There's an old monastery. Uh, I'm not sure. I haven't been, so I can't really say. I don't know. The visit is a direct translation of Mount Olive, where Jesus taught about the end days and the second coming. <clears throat> ooh, ooh. So we are about to finish the live stream. We've been here for about two hours, two good hours. In other news, Minister of Transportation, ha hey, okay, content time says, in other news, Minister of Transportation, Her Excellency, Minister African Tigress, announced tomorrow there'll be a national holiday to celebrate an important birthday Hell of yeah. this very beautiful queen. What is the weather like in Ethiopia? I think it, it's different from in different regions. If this was in Addis, I would not be out here in the balcony. Yeah, it would be cold. It would be very cold. But this is warm. This place is warm than Addis, so it depends. Addis is very chilly. Uh, chilly and dry. Yes. Yeah, it's very dry. Bring your lotions. Lotions don't work. Yeah, Specific type of lotions work, but yeah. I feel like my skin keeps peeling and is pale and it's... So I think maybe with time my body will adjust to this, but... Yeah. So you need to bring some special oils. I don't know what kind of oils that can help your skin from becoming pale. Vaseline, petroleum, and I Nivea. I hate petroleum jelly. Well, you can peel your skin or you can put that, my darling. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> but that's or you can put Nivea, Nivea, like you know, with the uh, strong one, mm -hmm. the full, uh, the full butter one. So that's the solution. I'm going to look for that because uh, I'm like, my skin gets pale and it's peeling. I'm like, what the heck? I miss Kasarani, Kiber and Kasarani. Okay, what's this? And I'm hurried. Wow, and I miss it. Uh, Zukwala. Uh, what happened to Zukwala? Zukwala is also another uh, church and monastery. So, but why are we talking about Zukwala? I don't know, maybe because of the, the, the Brazil. beautiful. I got it. Thanks. Ah, maybe it's Zukwala uh, monastery they're talking about. I have no idea. Oh, uh, in the Brazil. Thank you, ladies. Keep shining and show us our lovely African cities. Thank you so much. I think I stayed at that hotel when I was in Ethiopia. My friend who is an actress took me there. The drama she saw is Siu Le Siu. Siu Le Siu, okay. Oh, Siu Le Siu. Oh, okay, it's a drama series. Siu Le Siu means people to people. Okay, I love the African Tigress. How do I get in touch with you? Uh, Caroline, send me an email, but if you send me an Instagram, I also do respond. On Instagram, it's at Kenyan Sister. Or even if you search African Tigress, you'll be able to see me, my profile. If you go to my latest community post, you'll be able to see a link to my Instagram. My email is theafricantigress at gmail.com. So send me a message. Uh, does it feel weird to be in 2013? No. It's normal. I have an invitation for you to the most luxurious destination ever yay we're coming with her yeah where is it send me the link send me a message send me an email at the africantigress.com if you go to the description of all my videos you're able to get the link to my email the link to my instagram i think i'm more active on instagram email and youtube i need to work on facebook and twitter because the truth is i'm not like really active sometimes it takes days for me to see messages there but on instagram email and youtube i see messages faster so send me an email or send me a message on instagram you need shea butter uh, yeah, also shea yeah butter. i need to get shea butter cocoa butter try black seed oil just use dove moisturizer also. it works mm -hmm. uh Oh, what is her name in seal? The seal is done long time ago. Body creams are generally heavier than oil based and work better than lotions, which are usually water based. Shea butter or cocoa butter works great. Yeah, so someone sent me some shea butter. Can I get shea butter here in Ethiopia? Uh, I think so, yeah. Thank you so much. All right. I'll email you. All right. Thank you so much. Just use the Says African tiger. Kenyan tigress. Kenyan tigress. I'm Kenyan. You know, I have another YouTube channel known as Kenyan sister. Yes, I so do. So some people call me Kenyan tigress. African sister. African tigress. Don't even... That's a mosquito? Yes, I'm trying to kill the mosquito, but I killed my hand because I hit this thing. No are you going to Are you going to hotel with a big quarter? What the? Mm. With a what? Big quarter. 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 What does that mean? I don't know. All alls cost money. I'll email you. Yo, BJ, you coming when we finishing? Ethiopian ambassador. Never. Never uh, ambassy. That's my name. Oh uh, no, I, I thought you were talking about this. Rita found found a tiger in Ethiopia. No. Yes. yes. Who is the tiger? No. You are. I'm tigress, so they are asking for a tiger, like meaning a man or something. Ah. No, so all the things in life that that's uh, that's a question. Come on now, you can do better. I think they're talking about Middle East quarter. What does that mean? Qatar, or do they mean Qatar? I don't know. I don't know. 
I think they are talking about Middle East Corps. African Tigress is Nebir. Habesha Traveler is the ambassador. Ah. You want to take my name? I didn't say anything. He said. And <laughs> I'm never. I'm you're the like you're the tiger and, and you're the, the lion. Yes. In Ethiopia, I'm ambassador. Never ambassador. Never. That's I said it right. Never. Uh -huh. I'm never ambassador. So you're tiger lion. I'm lioness. Yes. A cocktail. Ah, you know a mixture of both. Meow. Yeah. Perfect. Mm. Meow. <laughs> <laughs> Is that meow? It's no. It's meow. <laughs> Pia Bata is from North Ivory Coast. I'm from DRC. I lived in South Africa for 15 years around Africa. I've been to. And right now, Navijan Ivory Coast. Woohoo! Where are you, Debrezit? Yes. Debrezit. As you can hear, the singing is. Yeah, meow. they say the singing is from Debrezit. I can provide you with the best chia butter ever. I'll be grateful. I will look into much more of your content soon. Much love for both of you. Thank you so much. Hello, Selassie. I know this person remembers you. You, you. Oh yeah, I know. Remembers you from Hello, Selassie. Yeah. How are you, darling? Ooh, Akata. Yes. He's a very good supporter of yours and very good supporter of mine as well. He came from your page to mine. What the f? Someone Holy is coming. Holy crap! This thing is so scary. How did the door open itself? There is some type of a ghost happening here. <laughs> I'm the first... <laughs> Rita, be respectful. So cute. Show us around. I've done that. Be said, stay tuned. Subscribe to this channel. Uh. There's a lot of videos. I give you a tour of the whole of this place. Like it's massive, it's beautiful, it's unique. It's like nowhere else in Ethiopia. Is it the best? Eh? Don't get me in trouble. It's very nice. <laughs> it's gorgeous. It's 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 the best. And there's also other bests as well. So it's one of the best, let's say. It's one of the best. Okay, I'm gonna find out off camera which one is your favorite. No, no, no. It's not like which one is my favorite. There are just a lots of places that are amazing. And this happens to be one of them. Okay. Uh, how, how Ethiopians know English so well? They learn it in school after grade seven, right? uh yeah but it's not because of that i think we just kind of try and before nothing like uh, now they translate everything but before everything came in original form so if something comes from outside like the packagings everything is in english the movies are in original form the music is in original form so you have no choice but to force yourself to understand it mm -hmm. so even when we were kids the cartoons everything was in english but now that has changed nowadays they're translating it so i don't know how the future generation is going to be but that's how i learned because everything was just not translated in original form mm -hmm. so you just force yourself to you know to understand and i had a great mother who would sit down and ask me what did they say? And then I would have to translate. And then if it wasn't okay, then she would make me watch it again. Mm -hmm. So that kind of helps. Yeah. Okay. Someone coming. Adesina, thank you so much for coming by this channel. I'll uh, subscribe. You know, you hit that like button and you'll stay tuned for some amazing content, traveling content all over. I mean, you're going to love it. It says Konjo, which means beautiful ladies. Konjo, I'm a signal. Private school, you learned in private school. Ladies, no. can you tell us about the ancient oils in Ethiopia? Someone says she loves that Oromo girl. <laughs> what an assumption. What, or who's Oromo? They assume you are. 
Oh, I am Ethiopian. So Oromia is in Ethiopia. So I guess if that's what you mean, then yes. Ethiopian traveler. Uh, oh my God, I love Ethiopia people. Jimariam. Jimariam means Gebra Mariam? Yes. What does they say? Yevit Sime Ambassano Ambassit Mokshina Pondro Havesha in Mechachu. He says, uh -huh. uh, My nickname is Ambassa. Uh -huh. So Ambassit uh -huh. in Mechish. And yeah, have a good time with the Havesha. Okay, thank Something you. Like thank you. Are you ladies? Debrezate. That's what I've been. That's that's that music you hear. It's it's that holiday. I don't know. Kiba butter. Thank you. Okay, I think I'm tired now. I don't see any question. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Go watch my other videos in case you've not watched. Hit the like button. Suggest videos. Follow me on Instagram for quick updates in case you want instant updates and videos, short video clips, photos, and all that. Follow me on Instagram. I think it's very, very, very fun because uh, you get them raw and unedited on Instagram. On Instagram, I'm Kenyan Sister, or you can still get it. Search for African Tigress. You'll see Kenyan Sister. That's me. And uh, yeah, still more amazing videos to come from here. Recommend my channel to your friends and wherever, everybody, your neighbors, even your frenemies. And uh, let's get to 100,000 by the end of this year. Like the goal is 100, but I know you guys can surprise me. I'm looking at it towards the end of the year, but if we keep the same trajectory, we, ah, we could be at 100,000 by August. When you get to 100,000, you're going to vote for a country that I should visit. So the one that would win or maybe we'll do something more interesting i don't know we'll figure out what to do at a hundred thousand so support a sister always always please remember to thumbs up my videos whenever you are watching you smash that thumbs up and we're good thank you thank you nice meeting you you know jamaica looks like ethiopia and jamaica look like ethiopia you took bob mali and we took else images everywhere are you going to like roof to resort <laughs> Subscribe to African Tiger because of Fabesha Traveler. Thank you so much, Mateka. You are awesome. My African queens, you both speak any other languages? Yes, yes, I speak Swahili. I speak my mother tongue. I speak lots of other languages. She speaks Amharic. She speaks other languages. Okay, ladies, good night. Late in Ireland. Bye-bye. Are you guys using uh, the hotel Wi-Fi? No. You know I'm using mob mobile data. I thought you were using no, the Wi-Fi. No, I'm not using the Wi-Fi. It was lagging and buffering, so I'm no. using mobile data. How many they are in Kruf to Bench de Brazil? Uh, I'm not sure. All right, all right. Thank you so much. Have a lovely morning, night, day, evening, wherever you are across the globe, and see you in my next video. Much love and respect. And happy birthday to the queen. Happy birthday to me. I've donated Thank you. I've donated the name Ambassit for you for one day. One day, just, just for today. my birthday. Just for your birthday. After just that, for my <laughs> birthday. It's okay. You can keep calling me Havesha <laughs> Traveler, Yodi, Sweetie Pie, Honey Boo, whatever you want. <laughs> All right. Quite hairy. Uh, salam to so Pittsburgh, Pennsylvania. Trust progress. Salam, salam. Uh, sawa lala salama na usilale na miwani. Ah, thank you, Lala. Now I Thank you, Kimfe. Are you ladies have boyfriends? <laughs> Why? I have a question. Okay. Why are people so obsessed about this? About having a boyfriend? Or about, you know, like this relationship type of thing? Why is that such an important thing? Like we give so much value, you can ask us so many questions. We have so much information, and that's the only thing you think of to ask us. It's very strange. 
Okay, the people who are in love with uh, Abesha Traveler, <laughs> slide to her YouTube channel and no. subscribe. That's, yes, the only, subscribe. that's the best way to express your love. Yes. So if you love her, you don't subscribe, then that's fake love and we are real. Dena Nadit. Waiting for you to visit Gion Hotel and Hotel Hilton. I stayed at the Hilton. Yes, I think those hotels are very nice and unique and historical and yeah we have been to the hilton we've been to hill we oh have, yeah we have been to the hilton right we haven't no we were tired we yeah okay we have to go there we have to go to no, the we were tired there. it's nice it's there like uh, the uh the hilton is very old and it's very beautiful uh the gion is also really nice and has a nice uh, garden and stuff mm -hmm. And can we get a tour of the bookshop? Bookshops. They want vi a video about bookshops. I know him. He likes reading lots of books, lots of history. So he's saying if we could do a video about the bookshops. Yes. Those days we could do a trip to Mercato. We were in Mercato. We went to Mercato. That I have a lot of videos I need to edit. Uh, we have so much videos so we need to work videos, on. So many videos. I need. I need help. Good night. Uh, let me. Gion is not expensive. Habari from U.S. Habari Ako. Okay, let me just end the stream. Thank you so much for watching. Thank you so much for supporting. I love you so much from the bottom of my heart. Take care and keep supporting Thank your you. sister here. National Theatre Bookstores. We passed by there. Yeah, we should. We did. But we didn't like really do it in details because yeah, people are not also like into the cameras, you know. Yeah. Mm, I had the first Obiscus this Hilton Hotel. Yes, I'd like to see the bookshops and the traditional musical instruments. We have a video about traditional musical instruments. I've just not edited yet. Uh, I need some hands. Good night. Bye-bye. Let me just end it. Bye-bye. Thank you. Bye.